One new study says a nature preserve and popular beach on Oahu is in peril. Our Jelani Martinez has more on the warning from researchers. Researchers looked into the impacts of sea level rise and say seven years from now, nearly 90% of Hanauma Bay's sandy area could end up underwater. Hawaii is the state of all states that really needs to be most concerned and start taking action for climate change impacts. Researchers from UH Manoa's Hawaii Institute of Marine Biology evaluated Hanauma Bay for five years. They predict 88% of its sandy area will be underwater by 2030, but it won't be an everyday occurrence. Important things we wanted to point out was that this is only during peak high tides or the king tides, uh, and that was in 2022, there were six days in the summer months um, where these high tides have occurred. Since reopening after a nine-month pandemic closure, the city's Department of Parks and Recreation keeps the preserve closed twice a week and has implemented a reservation system. This cuts the daily capacity to 1,400, nearly half of what it was before. But researchers say this could change when there are king tides. If they didn't close on those days, they could reduce the number of daily visitors on those days. Um, or people could be relocated onto the grass. The city continues to find a balance between preserving the area and maintaining cultural and recreational use. They've began using sea mattresses and doing restoration projects in other communities, but they're also working on long-term solutions. Our Office of Climate Change, Sustainability and Resiliency, um, they have a Climate Ready Oahu plan. Uh, that's an adaptation strategy uh, that they're going to be publishing soon. Uh, I believe next month they're going to be releasing it for public comment and they hope to finalize it this summer. Researchers say they'll work with the city to prepare and find alternatives and solutions to address climate change concerns. Reporting from Hanauma Bay, Jolani Martinez, Hawaii News Now.